What's up, y'all? Oh my goodness, what a special, special occasion. Cause we about to do this mukbang. But I got a special guest. Sweetie is here. Hello. Nice to see you again. Good to see you Last too. Last time I saw you, there was a squirrel on the table. They just want some nuts. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> they just want the nut. That's why I relate to, you know. <laughs> Oh, so you was too. There's a squirrel on the table. Uh -huh. We you you did my nails a little I bit. Did your nails. Ooh. So, oh my god. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Wow, this is not I'm feeling myself now. <laughs> okay, so let me ask you something. How do I wipe my butt? I learned a lot about you, but I feel like you know we're we're like BFFs now. Yep. You know what? I forgot to say we're doing this because it's Filipino Heritage Month. I didn't know hmm. that you were half Filipino. And Chinese. And Chinese. Mm -hmm. What's all what's all in there? So my dad's black, and then my mom is Filipino Chinese. Oh, okay. Have you ever had Jollibee before? No, I haven't, and I heard you haven't either. Dude, no, I haven't, so I'm super hyped right now. I heard the, the chicken at Jollibee is kind of crazy. Really? Yes. I didn't know you uh, were a foodie like that. I, I I don't play about my food. Okay. I fight over my food. Well, let's get it then. Let's see, let's see. What do we have? Oh, you want to dive right into the chicken? Oh, yeah. Let's do that. Were you supposed to wait for me? Oh my God, you're so rude, man. We got busted food. True. <clears throat> Go ahead. Okay. You pray to God or you just make sure? I pray for God. To God, you know what, Lord God? <laughs> just make sure. bless this food, sanctify, purify, take anything out that may be detrimental to our health. I know that's right. Mm -hmm. You just name my prayer, amen. Amen. I thought, I thought I was gonna pray. Well, you was taking too long. All right. Now we can start. Okay. Ready? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Could be a little crunchy, but definitely wow. it's nice and juicy. Wow, it's crunchy. It is crunchy? Mm hmm. Let me try it. Mm hmm. Make sure you guys hear it. Hey, some more. Mm hmm. That was good and got in my eye a little bit. Mm. The spicy one. Mm hmm. It's actually really good. It tastes like fried chicken. It is fried chicken. What do you mean? But like some black people fried chicken. Have you had a lot of Asian people fried chicken? Because Asian people fried chicken goes kind of crazy. No, you know what? You're right. Mm-hmm. You're right. Korean fried chicken goes crazy. Mm -hmm. Oh, and they barbecue do too. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Mm hmm I know that's right. Mm-hmm. I've never had Filipino spaghetti before, and everyone always tells me it's, it's like, hell is, it, is it? What's yeah. the difference between Filipino spaghetti and regular spaghetti? Um, and Filipino spaghetti, at least my Lola, mm -hmm. she puts in brown sugar and okay. ketchup. I like ketchup. Have you put it in your spaghetti? Never. Really? Really? I don't know if they make you it. You are taking forever. Oh my God. Well, if you would have put the proper <laughs> utensils in here and not this $2 fork, <sighs> <laughs> it'd be easier. Oh, you know what I always see people do? Oh, they, they, they gave us this whole thing of gravy. They always dip their Jolly Bee chicken into a, the, the tub of gravy. See, we supposed to have some sinigang, some mupia, some adobo. And where is that? I don't know. You, I mean, you said that you <laughs> was gonna take care of the food. I, I didn't say I was gonna take care. That was that was that was your person that took care of the food. Oh, so now we playing the, the blank game. <laughs> Hold on, I need to be so icy. I need to put on his jacket. You too icy. No, that's a good one. You are too icy. <laughs> <sighs> I mean, if you want to just put on your fur, just say that. <laughs> no, it's too icy in there. I need to put this coat. It's hot, y'all. It is. It's hot as it. <laughs> it's mad. That's a nice coat, though. I bought this shit just for the joke, and I was like, it's getting, it's getting too hot for the joke. That was a nice little flex. That was cute. Thank you. It's fake. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't going to bust you out. <laughs> the gravy in the chicken goes crazy. Mm-hmm. Hmm. I smell some, some garlic in here. So what do we what do we do? Um, John, you said eat the gravy with the with the with the rice. Okay. I didn't know Filipinos love gravy so much. I didn't know either. Hmm. Okay, let me do a uh, body chicken. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, I must try. The rice is kind of nice. Garlicky. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Mm. Filipino food. Would you go that that? Yep. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Yum burger. Man, this is gonna knock me out. Thank you. <laughs> what is a yum burger? Is this some Filipino thing? 
I mean, it's like it's like <laughs> Jollibee the, thing. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. It might have a piece of pineapple in it. I'm not sure. Okay, okay, interesting. Dude, people thought I was Filipino for years. I thought you was Filipino. Yeah, I let them think I was Filipino because Filipinos go so hard for their peoples. Imposter! <laughs> for the mukbang, I'm gonna do it, but I've never tried pineapple with my burger. Is that weird to you? I mean, it's just an interesting concoction. Mm. Mm hmm. You like pineapple on your pizza? Hell no, it's a crime. What? That's like you're a serial killer if you like pineapple on your pizza. It's the perfect balance. No, ranch on your pizza is the perfect balance. I mean, I like that too. So I, I take the pineapple on the pizza, dip it in the ranch with some sriracha. Mm hmm. That's a crime. Wait, 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 hold on, with the sriracha? Well, I like to mix my sriracha and my ranch. Sriracha. It's fire. Okay, I like to put hot Cheetos or ranch on my pizza. Same thing. You're okay. Your palate is, is, is unique. I saw you with the uh, hot Cheetos in the in the ramen. Yeah, so that's a Bay Area classic. It's fire. I'm scared of bars to the pineapple. Girl, just man up and take a bite of the pineapple. Oh, okay. Get into it then. I'm talking about my fucking bird. Okay. That's how you bite a burger. He's mm -hmm. giving y'all a tutorial. And then, okay. when everything leaks to the bottom, you turn uh, around, oh, yep. eat the ass. Mm-hmm. All the juice flows down to the booty of the, of the burger. burger. You gotta eat you gotta it from eat the back. back. You see? Mm-hmm. You got some kids watching. <laughs> <laughs> So you like booty juice. That's the best part. You got some right there. So that's what happens sometimes when you eat when you eat the booty. This is y'all might as well rate this R before the episode <laughs> start. Because now it's turning into some is it MC17? I gotta put my coat on, you too icy, man. Damn, you crazy, right? You too icy, oh my god. I know, you gotta you keep mean. bringing it back. It gets funnier every time. <laughs> <laughs> this chicken really good, though. The chicken is crazy. You know, I'm, I'm gonna try it. Did you dip it in the gravy? Yeah, yeah, you, you, got, you, got, you got your own oh, gravy over my there. Bad. Cause I was gonna ask you if you double dipped it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try it mm -hmm. with the gravy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, do it, do it, do it, do it. yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's pleasing me. Mm -hmm. And my homegirls. Mm-hmm. That this chicken is prepared so nice. Mm-hmm. I don't know that's right. You know I got a, a song with the Migos. Really? Me and Nick Cannon and the Migos and Future. Really? It's called Pajama Pants. Pajama Pants? Yeah. Let me hear your verse. Um, I, first of all, I got the hardest verse on that song. I know, let me hear it. I said, who got the nicest cakes up in their PJs? Could it be them East Coast mommies twerking up in BK? Whoa. Or could it be that LA face with a butt from BK? Oh. Either way, put that kick in my face like it's my B-Day. Booty juice. She know just what she doing when she doing what she does. Okay. I take a couple shots up off her booty till I'm bugged. That's right. Cause I forgot the rest. It's hard though. Dang, we was flowing. <laughs> Yeah. That was actually good. I know. Um, look that up. Pajama Pants, Nick Cannon, Migos, Future. Pajama Pants. Yeah. Okay, yeah. partner. It didn't do too well. That was Nick's fault, though. Oh, so <laughs> he's going to blame Nick. <laughs> when all else fails, blame Nick. Thanksgiving is coming up. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite Thanksgiving get dish? I'm a big honey baked ham guy mm -hmm. um, over turkey. Mm -hmm. um, how about you? I love macaroni and cheese, mm -hmm. greens. Mm -hmm. Um, you're 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 a side person. You like a lot of sides. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you, you I, just, know, I know where he's going with this. No, I was I just saying. You I like mashed potatoes? Gonna that's all. I ain't going to endorse that. <laughs> um, what else? Yeah, I'm not really a turkey person. Mm -hmm. mm, I'm trying to think. I do like the stuff in mashed potatoes. You know where you are, right? My my plate be full of sides. You just a side chick. Oh, is that right? <laughs> Yeah. If he goes missing after this episode, it was. <laughs> what is your like favorite thing to, to eat? If I was like, if I was like, yo, let's do a mukbang of your favorite food. 
What would it be? I would have hella oysters. Oh, okay, you have with the oysters. I would have crawfish oh. and I would have big crab legs. Yes. And sushi. I'm a seafood girl. Dude, okay, so you know what? I saw you do that. Uh, who was it with? You did a you did a seafood mukbang with somebody. Mm -hmm. And you were going in. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, she really likes food. Yeah. When you bite into a, a piece of crab, mm -hmm. and when you slurp that oyster, mm -hmm. it really does something to your soul. I feel that. A lot of people don't F with raw oysters like that, though. Really? I love raw oysters. I love kushi order. I love kushi you oysters. You said what? Kushi. Kushi oysters. <laughs> this the booty man, the kushi, kushi man. <laughs> what else are you going to say? What is a kushi oyster? No, kushi. Because I, I, I like kushi oysters, too. But wait, what are you talking about? You know what? Actually, <laughs> I'm going to put that in a song, the coochie oyster. No, I like already did it. I already did it. I put it in a song already. You, you can't copy me. Well, it's not about who does it first. It's about who do it the best. And I always do it the best. Hmm. Take that icy game. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's the difference between a, 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 what do you call it? Kushi and Kumamoto. Oh, okay. So I like the Kumamoto. I've never had. So it's similar. Okay. Nice, small, and plump. The little ones are like the sweeter ones. Um. Yeah, they're, they're creamier. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't really like the big oysters that look like they just weren't clean and they're they're like gucky. It's a whole lot. Yeah, it's a whole yeah. lot. It's like a whole tongue on your tongue when you do that. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Like a cow tongue. Yeah, but I like that though. Mm. You ever had the lengua tacos from the taco truck? Beef tongue? <laughs> what? You never had that? What is that? Go to an LA taco food truck and get the lengua tacos. That's not like some Hannibal shit. Nah, it's just a beef tongue. It's fire. The texture's different. Here, I'm gonna I'll try the cease now. Oh, in the it, little in the little shells. No, it was a really big cease that I was in London. It was mm -hmm. like this big, and they and they boiled it. Mm -hmm. And so, but when you, it's like huge though. Like the the meat of it is huge. Mm -hmm. That's what she said. But I could imagine it. It's it's like tough. It's chewy. It's chewy. Yeah, but it's chewy. But it's chewy and beef. Well, how was the sea snail though? It was good. Yeah. It tastes like a really big sneeze snail. Okay, bro, I'm gonna put you on game, right? What? Go to taco truck, get some lengua tacos, and get some cabeza tacos. Cabeza? What's that? The head meat. <laughs> Wait, what is, what is that? It's you, you go get some cabeza tacos, it's, and it's like this part of the cow. You know what I'm saying? And it's it's tender. It's tasty. Have you ever had someone cook a chicken for, for like in front of you? Like catch it, cut it, cook it? It tastes a lot different. Really? Mm -hmm. It's better? Um, it's, It has a, a fresher taste to it. Like, I feel like you can really taste the chicken. Taste the fear. I, I mean, hopefully <laughs> not. But I was in the Dominican Republic and we were staying on a farm. Mm -hmm. And the woman at the house caught the chicken, went to the butcher house, cut the head off, chopped it up, prepared it, and then served it. Damn. Who cares about chicken, right? <laughs> Fucking chicken, girl. We care about the chickens. Is there anything you won't eat? Um, I think I won't eat cow tongue. <laughs> you missing out. Really? Mm-hmm. You need to, you need to move outside of your comfort zone <laughs> and try some cow tongue, I think. <laughs> you just got all the jokes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. You ice, man. What, the what you grabbing? <laughs> oh, wow. Mm -hmm. That coat looks amazing. Chinchilla. Chinchilla. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. That looks very chinchilly. <laughs> My man. My man. <laughs> you full yet? Because hmm. we still got to have some uh, dessert. What is it? It's that Filipino dessert. The classic. Hollow, um, hollow. Hollow, hollow. Oh. Do you have what the hollow, hollow? I'm weird. I like. I don't really like halo halo. You don't? I, I like the um I like ice with the halo halo milk. That's okay, it. I feel that. Yeah, I was one I was a picky little kid. My mom used to get so mad at me, but I just like the halo I like the the, the milk and the, the ice cream. But you're a foodie now though, that's dope. Yeah. We got peach mango pies. I don't like pies. Man. You know what? Now I know how people feel when they eat with me. Because people don't like sushi. People don't like oysters. And people don't like sushi? No. But Who are you kidding I'm with? sitting with you, and you eat a lot of things that I don't like. So I eat now all. I know how people feel. Bro, I eat all the things, all right? Lengua tacos, whatever this was. I eat, I eat the ass. No coffee. <laughs> Let's try this hollow hollow. Oh my god, you are making a mess. No, I'm kind of clumsy. This place is, is rented. Yeah. 
Give it to us again. Give it to us again. That good ASMR. What is this again? Oh, flan. Flan, yeah. Yeah. Let's say flan. I'm very picky compared to you. I'm impressed. It's not a whole lot that I won't eat, to be honest. As long as it's like prepared right and like mm -hmm. flavored right, I'm pretty much going to try anything. Have you ever had chitlins? I have had chitlins. Did you like it? Oh, you know what? I haven't had chitlins prepared in like soul food chitlins. I've um, had like uh, tripas tacos, which is intestine tacos. And I've had like intestines in like um, the, when my mom makes soup. One of my guilty pleasures is I watch how like food is prepared mm -hmm. and I watch people eat interesting things. Mm -hmm. You ever see the video where they're eating like live squid? I've done that. <gasps> you can do it in K-Town. <gasps> oh, why the f So this right here, dog, you ready for this? Are tripping. This is live octopus. He's not actually alive right now. Of course he's dead. He got chopped up into a million pieces. What's happening is uh. it's just his nerves are still, you know, reacting. His nerves are still partying and twerking oh right now. Yeah. It's good. <laughs> Let's go. You would like it. Oh my gosh, do you feel it move around? Well, here's the thing, right? Because it's not alive still. It's it just, is alive. But it's, no, 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 it's alive really quick, right before they kill it and chop it up and put it on the table. When it's on the table, it's not alive anymore. He's just moving around still because like, you know, the nerves are still going or whatever. <laughs> So, it's pine more... apple on his pizza. See, he is serious. <laughs> really the eggplant up there is really bomb too. Actually, I do like eggplant. Yeah, yeah. The eggplant I catch is kind of crazy. I like all types of eggplants. Mm hmm. No, you play. <laughs> we have to redo this with my grandma cooking the mukbang. I'm down. No disrespect to Jolly Bee because <laughs> the fried chicken was amazing. The spaghetti was bomb. The chicken, yo, the, the chicken, chicken. That surprised me. I'd go over there and I'd pick up some chicken personally. Because I'm like a big. Go ahead and add that to our food list. Yeah, like churches and, and Popeyes. Like I'm a big churches dude. Mm -hmm. But uh, the Jolly Bees is it might be up there on my list now in terms of fried chicken. So uh, you know what you gotta do for fried chicken? Mm. I used to do this when I was a little kid. You get some sweet baby ray sauce, okay. some honey, mm -hmm. you put in a Tupperware okay. with fresh fried chicken and, and you shake it. Yeah. Ooh. I'm down for that. See, I like honey on my chicken. Me too. But see, so then you should like pineapple on pizza. <laughs> Dog, it's not the same thing. <laughs> we can agree to disagree at this point. I guess. You're about to convince me. <laughs> you put ketchup in your spaghetti. You are not about to convince me, my friend. <laughs> uh, well, all right. Hey, that was fun. That was fun. Happy uh, Filipino Heritage Month. Happy Filipino Heritage Month. Um, anything else you want to say before we wrap this up? Back to the streets is out. If you're dealing with an F with on Back to the Streets, ladies. Pretty bitch music on the way. Mabuhay, Filipina. I know that's right. And never ever wrong. Yup. All right, y'all. Thanks for watching. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. The royal penis is clean, your highness. Thank you. King shit.